Hello, this is Crafty Crafty, and today we are playing Crafty Permacraft Global. Okay, and as you can see, I'm currently making some... Where, is my, where are my potatoes? Yeah, there are. Eight potatoes, come here. Thank you. Okay, we are making some sandwiches. Which is quite important for us. And for our survival. Voila. Okay. Uh, as you can see, we made some small changes. I will now update you on them. But first, I'm going to tell you today's episode's main quests. Okay. Uh, during the updates that I make, I was making, I kind of realized something. I waste a lot of time while collecting wood. So, do you know what time it is then? It is automated tree farm time. Yeah, uh, we are finally going to make a tree farm. Which is a lot, a lot useful for us. Okay, should I make automated tree farm here or there? They will... There, it's kind of away from us, but it hits the bill. But as I as I can as you, I just said, it's a lot away from us, and the area is much more smaller, small. So yeah, I'm going to make it there. So let's expand to there. Uh, first things first. Uh, yeah, as you can see, I made some mechanical solves. Actually, I'm gonna need one more thing for this farm. Deployers. Yeah, I'm gonna make. I'm gonna need sixteen deployers, which is. Uh, I kind of regret that now. <laughs> okay, how many brass do I have? Not much. Not much. So, ah, also, we processed a lot of iron and co uh, copper. So, yeah. We are go good on iron. Okay, before doing that, uh, let me just update you on the changes I did. Okay, first things first. Uh, the barrel wall. I moved the barrel wall here, and it, it's mu much more fitting. Second, this area. Uh, I made two item, large size alt item vaults, and they are holding items. And so let me just show you. There is a another a two sets of chutes here, and. In this area, yeah, you can see one smart chute directly connects to that, and the other is just connecting with one another chute. So I can just do that. Actually, if you think about maybe reversing it would be more beneficial, but it's too late. Uh, the rest of them is kind of messy at the moment, so I need to fill them and check them later but the top part is quite automated every kind of uh, sand and cobblestone and gravel i have is sorted so yeah by the way this is going to be the input chest so yeah also, this gold, I mined a lot with this fella. Also, I added some more chests. And there there was a hematite ore next to it, which is currently doesn't exist anymore. I mined every single of one of them. And <clears throat> let me just show you the others small but good stuff okay i change redesigned here a bit i 
fully upgraded uh, blast furnace. This is fully upgraded blast furnace, which is which can hold process twenty ingots at the same time. So yeah, also there is a pipe connecting to it. So yeah, I can easily pull all the water from here. Uh, not water, pig iron run uh here and just make them into ingots okay that's two and i think that's no that's not it there's one uh, two more things one is i just add a temporary place for it like another uh encased fan water and that to wash stuff it's not a the best place but it works and yeah i changed the ladder with copper one actually i think i can make the the other one but igneous it requires igneous alloy so i just didn't care about it and one more thing I did some more uh, yellow sand and get some uh, glowstone with that. So I made this incandescent oil, which is quite simple actually. Incandescent oil. It's requiring a heated basing with mixer and glowstone and olive oil. That's it. That's just it. And it works. They are currently in cancelled oil and they do not deplete at all. So yeah, we are <laughs> getting somewhere. But I need a lot more glowstone too. Also, let me just show you one thing. This try one thing. The site is good. Yeah, come here, my friend. I will need you to do something special for me. And you will give me my resources. Okay. Now, why I am speaking in a Romanian accent? Actually, fake Romanian accent. More like a vampire one. Uh, because I probably have flashbacks from my pre uh, one of my previous series that is crafting in dystopia so, which literally means craft his dystopia okay we got some ores it's not much but if we process a large amount of uh cobblestone we will get a lot of ores with it okay let me just put them there Oh, also, I got him tight. Nice. And I put a clutch here. Nice. Good. 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 Okay, just now, uh, after we finish the updates, let me just craft some deployers. Terraforming! Terraforming! Terraforming is our passion, guys. Remember, the game's actual name is not Terraforming Craft, it's Terraforming Craft. And that's actually a joke, by the way, uh, if you do, do, did not get the sarcasm part. But yeah, uh, we are gonna do a lot of terraform, a lot of terraforming. So, let me just do that. Also, I craft the deployers. And get some stuff to handle things. Okay, we are ready. Now, let's make our first place. I will just uh, eyeball the placement of the farm. Okay, we... Uh, I think we found our area. And we will replace our first machine mechanical bear okay that's the area and 
and then we will put one block here two two six actually i don't need much uh chest because it uh i think but yeah let's use should i use chests or woods hmm good question the wood would be much more uh, aesthetically pleasing but chest would be more functional but but let's go with aesthetically pleasing. And uh, you also have to use more than one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes. Okay. Now. We did that. And after that, we need to make... I put our mechanical solves. Let me just uh, dig this area and put our solves. I hope this is the wrong uh, right rotation or uh, I have to move everything apart. Okay, that too. And we need Deployers that are two block higher. So let me just grab some wood. Okay. The half of them is going to be chests and rest of them. No, not like that. Rest of them are. How can I manage to keep putting here? It's just wood. And the last part. The, my old friend's deployer. Okay, and let's just place them in same rotation. Okay, this is basically our entire uh, structure. So let me just... Oh, I think one of the... Whiskeys, what the cider? No. Oh, I think the yeast starter, they, they, they keep cycling. Okay, let me just get some chestnut seeds and turn them into chestnut saplings. Okay, those are the, the not vanilla, the Terra Firma Craft version of the saplings itself. And do this. And put them... Just here. Okay. That should be enough. For now. After that, we'll just clear this area. And we need to make a mechanism for it to work. And for that, we are going to dig holes. Okay, uh, temporarily I'm going to uh, move it with a hanged crank for now to show you how it works. But we are going to uh, connect it to a actual power source, which is actually uh, our, going to be our second windmill, not the. The, our first meal is our mining machine, but we are going to have a second one. Uh, the second one is just going to power our three farms for now, because it will be a small one. I might actually place an actual big one in the future. Why do I use a windmill here? Because it's... Uh, a bit far from my actual power source. Okay, let's... Uh, of course, of course, I'm not... I didn't connect here. This. 
Okay, let's connect you and then connect you and then connect you. Okay, that should work. Also, I need to shift click. As you can see, it plays a lot of saplings, so we're having saplings a lot, <laughs> a lot of them. And I need to clear this area a bit. Okay, what will going to happen? Uh, this area is going to be our uh, actual tree farm. And it's they will grow. And they will get placed. And they will get cut. Okay, let me just do one more round. And, as you can see, it places everything, and I need to remove the torches from the... This places, okay, this is uh, the brock itself. And then, just run this. And, after I connect it to, to power, I am going to need to create... Actually, yeah. The windmill can be here. Actually, let me think. I think I'm going to make it a bit higher. Okay. And windmill bearing. Oh, I need... A vertical gearbox. I'm going to... Okay, that works too. And I will going to fall. Scaffolding. Come here, my friend. My old friend. My old reliable friend. I said reliable. Why you are... Doing this? Okay, mechanical bearing. Windmill bearing. Okay. Thank you, and I'm going to need this. Wait. Not this way. Okay. I'm going to move the scaffolds for a bit. Here. To see my friends here. I need to learn better grammar, but the English is not my native language, so you can just excuse me. Okay, one, two, three, and... Four. Not you. Okay. Okay, let's make... I'm not the best designer, by the way. Uh, as you clearly see. <laughs> and let me just glue everything. Glue, 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 glue. Which is what... Uh, I think Turkey. Yeah, the bird one, not the country one. Uh, says <laughs> in Turkish. So yeah, let's make glue glue. And so let's make our path to the place where the energy got you uh, is going to be used. Okay, and. I think I'm going to need a lot more uh, shafts. Uh, maybe not. Uh, maybe that would be just enough. Okay, vertical gearbox. Actually, I don't need the vertical gearbox because I'm going to use... Okay, uh, first belt. Come here. And shafts 
no, not this way. Thank you. Okay. Belt. Come here. And come here. Okay, the first belt is connected. And then, yeah, I'm going to need more uh, shafts. Let me just get them. Okay, I just decide to use shafts instead, instead of uh, belts. It will be a bit more expensive, but it will be a bit uh, also much more easy, easier to manage. Okay. And you come here. And uh, one more vertical gear box. Okay, and... And a gear box. Uh, where was it? Here. Okay. I think this should work now. Okay, scaffolding, come here. By the way, what happened to my scaffoldings? I'm using them to create barrel holders. Okay. Not this. Okay. That's the correct way. And I don't need them to this to run fast. Actually, let me just do this and Yeah, no, 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 no. Let's use 4. 4 is good. Okay. It's working. And now let's uh, for testing, I'm going to use something fun. You will see. It's quite interesting uh, thing. By the way, do I have... Yeah, uh, let me just show you how I pro put those here. Okay. Also, uh, let me just uh, feed my wolves and dogs a bit. I'll be right back. Okay, the tree fertilizer. They should just work. Okay, why didn't I use the three fertilizers before? Because uh, okay, it's cutting. They do not work on the dynamic trees. Trees. So yeah, I needed uh, the vanilla terraforma craft trees for that. And if we look, where at ah, the chest wall. Chests were at the end. Yeah. I think the other one is... And I cannot access it yet. Okay. And I got hurt. Yep. It's working. And does it collect the set links? Yeah, it's also... Puts them into... The deployer, I guess. Yeah, it's working. By the way, why didn't I put uh, much of a, a chest area? Because I'm going to create something. Uh, what was it? Great. Uh, what was your name? You made with shoot. Okay, portable storage interface. I'm going to create that, and this will connect to a storage interface. As you can see, in uh, as you can understand from the name. And let's do... This. Uh, this or the brass one. I think this, yeah. Uh, it's a bit expensive, but uh, who cares? I want to make it look good. Or again, just uh, cover it with something nice, but this works. Actually, this works quite nice because it uh, kind of fits with the gearbox itself. So, yeah. yeah, we have that too. And one last thing is I just need to cover this area too. Okay, let me just cover it and we are back.
a KR Lalo machine works. Works uh, just that, just like that. Okay, and one more thing. I have still enough material to create one more machine exactly like that. Why? Because I'm going to do that. Not now, it's uh, just in the uh, in a small fish. Uh, why I'm uh, going to do that? Because I need, need uh, birch too. Uh, because I'm using birch a lot. So, yeah. Our first... And it's a bit scary, I think. Uh, I need to move uh, chests a bit. Yeah, it's it cuts. Okay, I go, I'm going to do one more thing in this episode, and then I will create the second one in the off uh, off camera. Okay, the other things I think we are going to do is actually an alloy. Yeah. We are going to create a new alloy. And as you can see, we have pig irons. Okay. Pig iron. Sure. What we are going to use pig iron for? Because I, uh, if we remember correctly, it's not uh, useful by itself. It's, it needs an, uh, to be processed and turned into steel, right? No. Black steel. Uh, first, we are going to need... Ah, oh, wait a second. Pig iron. Pig iron can be compressed with weak steel ingots. Weak steel ingots. How we are making that? Steel, black bronze, and nickel. Black bronze is made by combining copper, silver, and gold. Sure, okay. And then we are combining this with nickel and steel, and we are making a weak steel. And then we combining. Oh, okay, we can make solder. Solder is used for. Yeah, rotations. Speed controller, nice. Or you can just do that. Um, that's much more cheaper. Why do I? Why should I use? Oh, okay. These are returns too. Now I understand it. Same for that. Okay, let me. Weak steel. If we mold it, weak steel ingots, and then we can. If we can combine high steel, uh, high carbon black steel ingots, and. It turns into black steel, which is our next uh, level. Okay, let me just do the alloying part, which is quite annoying. Okay, weak steels are ready, and let's just move them. Okay, they are coming fast, and... Weak steel ingots, and if we just combine them with box, we are going to get our first. Oh, by the way, black bronze is here, and yeah, I, I can make uh, more later, but I kind of do not want to. I just want to finish getting our first batch of. Uh, This and black steel first. Okay, let's do this. And yeah, I need, I'm going gonna need flux too. Okay, flux and come here. Five. Okay, let me try. 16 at a time. Is that enough? I 
think yeah i think it's going it's going to chew them no no problem okay and then the last part Uh, it's uh, super fun to watch these machines. <laughs> okay, and let me just... Uh, I need to just hammer them, right? Yep. Let's hammer them. Why are not hammering them? I can't... Why you are not hammering those? Alright, see... Blue steel. Ah. Ah. You require a higher tier of hammer. I see. I see. I see. It's one of the most annoying things in this game. Okay, I'm going to need. I am going to manually hammer you. Uh, by the way, your melting point is... Okay, brilliant light. No problem, no problem. And... I think I'm going to... Do two of them. Uh, just now. Because... Actually, one is enough. Because I'm going to create one hammer. Actually, two hammer. Yeah. Two hammers and then we will move on. Let's just make this into a reality now. Let's wait. Oh, also I need to stop this. Okay, we got our first uh, black steel ingot. And of course we cannot work with it. Okay, I... I just realized something. I need to make... Okay. And... Let's finish our anvil and... Do the painstakingly long part of... Uh, combining everything. Okay, I will be right back. Okay, time to make double ingots. And charcoal, of course. Okay, we have enough to make a anvil now. I would like steel anvil. Let's make it quickly and after that, let's make our first hammer and process everything uh, much more simpler. Okay, let me just put you here. I will just... Then, okay, hammer, 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 okay, hammer is ready, and should I have, I should have a stick, okay, and we have our first black steel hammer, and let me just craft the second, actually, do I need the second one? Yeah, let's make it. Thank you. Okay. The second hammer is also ready and... Voila. Let's replace this with this. Yep. Uh, works like a charm. Oh, yeah, I put the unknown ingots there. Okay, black steel is ready. And we are going to use black... By the way, we are not going to make any black steel tools because I'm going to use black steel for creating blue steel. And red steel. Yeah, that's going to be the next... Uh, uh, main part, but first I have something urgent to do. I need to find paper. Okay. And it's not... Uh, I don't have anything 
uh, any paper near me. So yeah, I'm going to have an adventure. After I uh, after I uh, process everything and have my farms uh, taken care of. So yeah, fun. Now, but we can finish the episode now. So this is Crafty Crafty and have a nice day.